a pretty good commercial game scene, like there are networking drinks and um, sort of conferences and things like that organised around the commercial games industry, but there wasn't anything regular um, that was aimed at beginners, students, hobbyists, indies, people who might like to give it a go but didn't know if they liked it. Yeah. in either April or May of uh, 2013 um, and I think there were maybe about a dozen people there. I'd been expecting to, maybe two or three of my friends. To I think everybody who turned up I already knew from somewhere but still I didn't know them all well um, so that felt like that felt like a good start. Now we're up to um, maybe between 40 and 60 people regularly. Um, it's been a really popular event which is good but um, more than that I think it's been the event that we wanted to run. Um, both Eddie and I had in mind a very particular sort of event like sort of definitely non-commercial, definitely diverse and welcoming. Um, Bright Indies is a friendly meet-up in a pub where people can talk about games and that includes everyone so if you work in games if you're a student just getting into the industry or if you're just interested in it and maybe want to find out more about games then you can come along and just talk to people who know might know a little bit more than you or you can find kindred spirits that you know can have a little journey with. <laughs> Um, Brighton Indies are on the internet. Uh, we're on Twitter, we're on Facebook, and we have a very poorly maintained website that nevertheless has all the facts. Um, just Google Brighton Indies, you'll find us. Um, but it's reliable as clockwork. We're just here the first Wednesday of every month in this pub.